Okay, so Gemini Man, directed by Ang Lee, starring Will Smith and Will Smith. So, oh, I had such high expectations for this movie. I was so excited. The trailers had me. Will Smith, love him. Action, Ang Lee. What more do you want? And, uh, my God. Unfortunately, I was really disappointed in this film. Really disappointed. I mean, there's a lot here. Uh, just so much. So let's start off with the good, which I thought Will Smith was was great. He was great as he as he always is. He's always great in these sort of films. He was fantastic. The supporting characters, Wong, I thought he was brilliant. Yeah, uh, he just gives that subtle comedic relief that you need, and he's a funny guy, of course. And Mary Elizabeth, I think. Her name is? She was good as well. But really, how do I put this? Their main role, her main role in this movie was basically to be there with Will Smith as he was going on this journey to have someone to talk to. That's really what her character is. The script is just, yeah, I can see why people have been saying that the script is not very strong. And it's not. There's so many times that they repeat, repeat, repeat. And I'm like, okay, we get it. No, 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 no. It's you. Okay, we get it. No, no, no. It's definitely you. It's like, we know. Like, how could you... Like, he looks like you. You've... Like, how... We know this. And they just repeat it at you all the time. And I'm like, well, I already know that. You've said it once. I can kind of tell. And it just keeps going, going, and going. And... The plot of the movie, we've seen this plot over and over and over again. Spy works for an agency. Spy gets out. Agency gets another spy. The spy hunts the spy. Boom. Same. So, you just, it's the same plot over and over and over and over again. So, it was nothing new that we ha I hadn't seen before that I was hoping for. I was hoping for this was going to be something really good was going to dive into some things that I hadn't seen. I was going to dive more into where did this clone come from? How? Why are they doing this? There must be a reason behind it. And there was no. It wasn't really anything that I kind of was like, oh, that's interesting. It was kind of just like, well, I've seen this before. Now, the frame rate. This is normally what the movies are, are at. Is, uh, I think it's 24. 24 to 30 frame rates. This is 120. And I tell you what, it pulls you out of the movie sometimes. It does. I mean, there's some things where I'm just like, oh my god. I was like, so, 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 what, wait, holy, that didn't look like what it would look like before. And I was just, it, it's off putting. The frame rate is off putting. So that was unfortunate. I, I can, it's just, yeah, it wasn't, how do I put it? It just, it really took you out of the movie. I was right out of that movie in that in the particular scene where it was very visible. I was kind of just sitting there like, okay, what am I watching now? It's just, that doesn't look right. It just didn't look right. The de-aging. There is scenes that it looks phenomenal. Absolutely phenomenal. And then there's a scene in broad daylight that I can tell you now, it looked as it looked worse than say, for instance, like a Far Cry cutscene. It looked worse than that. Like it looked like a video game character, the way he moved, the way he looked, and I was just like, so off put, so off putting that was, and I was just like, how did this get in? How how wait, who passed this? How, how is this in here? How did they look at that scene and go, you know what? That looks great. Just put it in there. It looks fine. But sir, uh, it it looks worse than, than a video game. No, 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 no. Put it in there. Let's get this movie out. I don't care. It looks good to me. But no, just do it. And then the result is, I don't believe that at all. That just, it was so off-putting, that scene. I was just like, I can't believe they let that in the movie, like how? 
So, I mean, overall, it's not a great movie. The action is, it is good in certain parts, but otherwise the frame rate and that just kind of take you out of it. I mean, it's just, yeah. And like, oh, I just wanted more. I was really disappointed. I was hoping for more. I was hoping for more story, a stronger story. We were really going to dive into things. And I mean, for this to be in development and been passed along for so many times, how this just got made without, like, it needed to be tightened up. The script needed to be tightened up. It needed another re, like, it just felt like a draft. And they went straight with it. And they should have just tightened it up more. So, unfortunately for me, Gemini Man is very disappointing. I'm quite disappointed in it. I had high hopes after the trailers. So, to be honest with this, I would say probably wait for this one. Wait for this one to come on Netflix. But then again, some people may like it. I mean, there's probably going to be some people that will love it. I mean, go check it out for yourselves, especially if you're Will Smith or anything like that. Check it out. You may you may love it more than me, but for me, I was disappointed in it. And, yeah, unfortunately, I've been let down. So, see you guys in the next video. Have yourselves a lovely day. Peace out.